Hi my lovelies, it's Dana again and we are here for a late March favorites video. I recorded one but then it didn't look greatest, the greatest so I re-recorded it. So that's gonna, we're gonna hop right in. So let's start, I have a list on my phone, I love, I love lists. Oh and if anybody wants to know, I got my phone case. Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> I got this from Rue21. Awesome. But anyway, so it is uh, Monuments Men. It has George Clooney, Matt Damon. Second movie of this week that I love is uh, Divergent. I know that's on everybody's list of that they loved. I will say, disclaimer, I, I loved the movie, but they really could have done a little, just a tad bit better on um, sticking with the book, especially on that awkward, like, kiss scene between uh, Triss and uh, Four. Is my Nature's Path uh, cereal. It is in honeyed cornflakes, and this is the greatest. If you have, like, a health food store where you live or a... Maybe you can find them in your grocery store. I know I find them in my health food store. But if you are gluten-free like me, um, this is gluten-free cereal. This is not made with wheat. Uh, and it's low-fat, and it's really great, and I, I just love it. I love, love, love this cereal, and it is super hard to find. And when I move to college, this is going to be the hardest thing. Probably I'm going to ask my parents to send them in care packages to me. So, moving on to the second favorite food of the month. My Annie's bunnies, Annie's cheddar bunnies. These things are the greatest. And I know I just said I was gluten free and it, you know, it says made with organic wheat. You know, there are, there are days when I don't follow that gluten free diet and I probably should, but I'm gonna get better at it. <laughs> but these are like a nice little snack for when I'm at work and I feel hungry but I don't feel like really really hungry so these are a great snack and they and they I think they are better in my opinion they are so much better than Cheez-Its or any other uh, cheddar cracker you can find out there because they're they're made with organic everything and I love organic and yes this is a must so Annie's bunnies I'm pretty sure you can find it in any grocery store um, this is both in my health food store and in the grocery store where I live. So, thumbs up to both of these. My hot glove because I got a curling, I got a curling iron that didn't come with uh, one of the hot gloves, you know, like the sh uh, like the chai ones do. So. I went to Sally's Beauty and I bought one of these. This was, I want to say $6 and it was great and I love it and it really does protect your hand because I have um, super short hair. Well, not like super short. I have it up and up there right now if you can see. But it, it's like, you know, down to here and so when I try to curl it, it doesn't... I had to be very careful. <laughs> so this is great. I love this. This is my favorite product for like ever. makeup product of all time is this Benefit lipstick and I went to Ulta today and I asked the guy I said hey you know do you I know Benefit redid their packaging redid their products for their lip products uh, do you have do you know if they have it in uh, this color and this is this color is called a uh, fame game it's a very nice uh, skin tone color, like almost a champagne-y. I know it's great for work because I work in a very um, conservative store, so I kind of have to uh, wear more conservative makeup and I can't go around wearing my oh current like dark plum <laughs> lipstick which I love but I can't go around wearing that so I have to find another one and this is awesome um I think I think maybe if you went on benefit like online you could find it but I tried to find it in like in the stores and I can't because I want to say that this was a uh, limited edition thing for Black Friday 
and I'm gonna miss it and I'm trying to find a replacement for it but so this is faves uh, next fave is going to be my uh, tart lip exfoliator I can't say the first word I, I know if I tried I would have murdered it but this is a great lip exfoliator I live in a very in a cold climate I live in Michigan so it gets cold very easily and it's still cold even though it's supposed to be spring but so this has been great for me from the winter for my dry lips so I would highly recommend you buying this I believe this was $16 when I bought it at Ulta so it's fairly inexpensive and this little thing it's uh, 0.7 ounces this has lasted me through the winter and I still have some left so it lasts a long time my next product is going to be my uh, Color City Be Matte Blush in Fresh Melon. I got this from my in my um, Ipsy bag, and this is just a great like color, and it's very subtle. Like you kind of, I mean, it doesn't look like it would be subtle from the color right here, but it's subtle when you rub it on your, when you put it on your cheeks. It just gives you a nice flush of color, and I really like wearing it when I'm at work because my skin gets oily at times, and this like mats it up and it soaks it up the oil <laughs> ahead of time. Now. I uh, I just got a wax burner. It's in the shape of a little can a little owl, and I love it. Um, and so the, the little scent of uh, blocks that I put into it. My favorite one this month has got to be the Thai lemongrass, uh, saga scent, and it's I love lemon. I am obsessed with lemon. I love 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 it. I bathe in like a lemon body wash. Um, so the, it is great. So that is my favorite scent of the month. So I will see you next month for my April favorites. Love you lovelies. Mwah.